Hello students, myself Ayushita. I welcome you on Envira Online School. Today we will start now our next question. Question B. First, read the question. Complete the following sequence. You have to complete this sequence by filling these blanks of numbers supporting the pattern. You have to follow the pattern and fill the blanks. First, find the relation between given pattern and then fill in the blanks with the same relation. Okay? Question number 1. Relation between 4 and 7. Gap between 4 and 7 is 4, 5, 6 and 7. Gap between 4 and 7 is number 3. So, what is relation between 4 and 7? When we add 4 plus 3, we get 7. Right? Now, relation between 7 and and 10, 7, 8, 9 and 10. Number 3. Gap between 7 and 10 is number 3. Relation between 7 and 10. 7 plus 3. Then we get 10. So 3 and 3. The pattern in this pattern, repeat number 3. So next, for getting the next number, we have to add 3 in 10. So 10 plus 3, 10, 11, 12 and 13. 10 plus 3 is equal to 30. So next number is? 30. Now, we get the next number by adding 3 in 13. Why we add 3? Because the pattern follows the number 3. So, 30 plus 3, 13, 14, 15 and 16. So, next number is Number 16. Now, next number. Forget next number. We add 3 and 16. So, 16, 17, 18 and 19. So, the next number is number 19. Next number is 22. Let's check. That our pattern is correct. 19 plus 3. 19, 20, 21 and 22. Yes, our pattern is correct. Let's go to our next question. Question number 2. 1 and blank. How we get the relation? No. Next. Here. Here we want to make a relation between 81 and 243. When we have small numbers, we have add and less. But when we have big numbers, how can we add the very big number? Now, we are doing multiplication. So, which number will multiply by 81? We get 243. Let's start with the smallest number. Number 1, 81. Multiply by 1 is 81. Next, number 2. 81 is multiplied by number 2. So, 2. 8 to the 16. No, this is wrong. Now, number 3. 3 and 3 is the 24. 243. And our number is 243. 81 multiplied by 3. We get 243. 
get this number. One is multiplying by three. So when we multiply one is to three, is we get number three. Now nine is given. So let's check. Our, our pattern is correct. Three multiply by three. Three ones are three. Three twos are six. And three threes are nine. Yes, our pattern is correct. Next, for getting next number, multiply by three. Nine multiply by three. Nine ones are nine. Nine twos are. 18 and 9 threes are 27. Now 27 multiply by 3 and we get 81. Now plus plus 243 multiply by 3.
gap between 10 and 20 is number 10. Gap between 20 and 30 is also number 10. Now, for the next, we also add 10. 30 plus 10 is 40. 40 plus 10 is 50. 50 plus 10 is 60. Next, 60 plus 10 is 70. This pattern complete. Let's go to our next question. Question number 7. 7. Black. Black. 22. 27. And 32. Next. Find our relation between 22 and 27. This is an increasing order. So we have to add 22. 23. 24, 25, 26 and 27. So, gap between 22 and 27 is 5. So, here adding 5. Next, 27 and 32. Let's find out. 27, 28, 29. 30, 31 and 32. Number 5. So, here is 5. The 5 is repeated. So, the pattern is making by adding 5. So, the 7. Forget the next number. We have to add 5. 7 plus 5. 7. 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. Here is 12. Forget the next number. We add 5, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 and 17. Next is 17. Let's check. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 and 22. Number 5. So our pattern is correct. Next plan here. 32 plus 5 and get the next number. 32 33, 34, 35, 36 and 37. So, next is 37. Here, our chapter is completed. We learn about series. Which series? Number series in this chapter. Then, our pack number pattern is in increasing order. We have to add and when the given pattern is in decreasing order, we have to less. And when we have big numbers, we also find out with 